Hi everyone, hope you're doing well. So this week in Arts and Crafts, we're gonna do part two of our Recycle Old Books, okay? So part one will be linked at the end, so go check that out once you've watched this. But, so for this activity, you're gonna need your book, the one we chopped out. You are gonna need a firm bit of card or canvas, okay? You're gonna need some PVA glue. You're gonna need a place to put your PVA glue. You're going to need a pair of scissors, so be careful. You are going to need a pencil. Any pencil will do. You're going to need your trusty glue brush. All right. You're going to need a thinner bit of card that's quite flexible, okay? All right then. So we put all this to one side. So you're going to need your book and your scissors. All right then. So in your book, you're going to need a piece of, you're going to need a piece with lots of writing on. So I'm going to choose this one right here, okay? So we're going to chop this straight down the line, chop it up, okay? So, grab your page nice and gently, and just gently try not to rip it, because you can use the pages again for a different activity, so you can do the same thing, but on a bigger scale, all right? So, put the book to one side, here it is. So we are going to Chop the bottom off very close to the words, okay? Like so. We're gonna chop the other side up all the way to the top. Get as close as you can to the words and do exactly the same here at the top. Boom. We're gonna trim this side up a bit because it's a bit tatty. And down we go. Pow. So, you should have one page out with The bit chopped off, here we go, like so. Okay, so we wanna take the top off and get it gone. We wanna take the side off and get it gone, the other side and get it gone, and the bottom and get it gone, so you're just left with a nice blank page like that. So do that four more times, okay everybody, and then we'll crack on. So I've got mine four all cut out and all the sides have chopped off, so we're just left with words now, okay. So the book is done, put that to one side. Now we are going to need a firm bit of card, okay. So put the card down in front of you. We want to make sure these all fit on. So for now, we're just gonna see if they fit into the corners, like so. We don't want it over the edge, we just want it snugly on the edge, okay. So I want to fit it on quite nice, it doesn't matter if they overlap, like so, and the last one, on we go, okay, so mine will fit on very nicely, like so, so we're going to take them off, we're going to get our trusty PVA glue, we're going to get our pot or holder, whatever you're using, we'll squirt a bit in, we don't need a much, we don't want to waste anything, so I've only put a dab in there, okay, so trusty glue brush. Check. Now, grab your words. Now, very important, we make sure we get around all the edges, okay? We're gonna do every single edge, all right? Down, around, and then all over, okay? So let's get that done. There we go. Get that glue all over it. There we go. That's it, covering it everywhere. So now we are going to stick it down like so. Make sure you push all the edges out. You don't want any creases, all right? And I, can you see how I am just on the line, not hanging over? All right? So. Let's do it like that, and then just like that, we'll have all four done. And if like magic, I have mine all stuck down and ready to go. So, hopefully they're all over the edges nicely, they're not over the edges, and it's all stuck down really nicely, hopefully for you. It looks a bit like this, probably better, because we all know, the past videos you've been sending in your work, and it looks so much better than mine. All right then, guys. So, we're gonna put our glue to one side, Trusty glue brush to one side too. Let's put this, oh, trying not to peel it up, eh? Over here. So now we have our flimsy bit of card, okay? So there's choices here. 
you can draw your picture on and cut it out or you can print it off a picture and you can stick it on and trace around it so it's like super cool okay but I don't have a printer here because it's broke unfortunately so you're gonna have to pull up with my dodgy my dodgy drawing skills okay so if like magic there will be a drawing there and here we go so as you can see my Batman symbols not the best not too good at drawing okay but do something like this print one off do a cool picture draw around it and then you're going to cut it out so with your scissors you want to pop this out okay so just like magic again it will be cut out and boom here we go so we've got our batman symbol all right so now get yourself your glue and your trusty brush and we need this thing swimming in glue, okay? So get absolutely loads of glue on there. Tons of it. Make sure every part of this Batman symbol or whatever you have drew or printed off, just get gluing on there like crazy, all right? Absolutely tons of glue on there like so. Now, very carefully take your, oh, don't get it stuck to the table, Nick. Take it to your, Thing you made so my Batman symbol's a bit too big to go portrait, so I am going to stick mine landscape. Okay, so then just push him down, whatever you drew, just drew, drew, get it stuck like so, and give it a push. Yeah, you give it a push for a bit longer, but. I don't want to make this video too long for you. So we are just going to show you what it looks a bit like. It will be all stuck down later if it, once it dries. So here we go. This is our arts and crafts for this week. You can do tons. If you've got more card, bigger canvas, you can go crazy with it, all right? So if you've just come across this video and you don't know what Where Next is, a link will be right around here to Russell Wall's email address. He is our operation and you can ask him questions about Where Next or to come and join us here at Where Next. Give him an email and he'll be getting straight back to you as soon as he can. So thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Link one to the Arts and Crafts part one will be right here. All right, and then hit that subscribe button as well. Once you've done, let us know you enjoyed it. Send us a picture to the Where Next Hub's Facebook page and let us know how you get on. Thank you very much. Bye.